Counter-Strike 2 is a game from 2023, which is currently running on the latest version of the Source 2 engine, and these are the minimum system requirements of the game. So let's see how much performance we can achieve on our low-end machines after applying some graphical tweaks. Let's get started. First of all, let me clarify that I'm going to run this game using my integrated graphics. I've set the screen resolution to 1080p, and everything else is set to their lowest preset. Now, let's see how it performs. You can clearly see the performance of the game, and I'm getting very low FPS. Now, let's quit the game and see what we need to do to improve its performance. First of all, we are going to start with launch options, which are essential for optimizing performance. By utilizing specific commands, we can enhance FPS and overall gameplay. Now let's launch the game and witness the difference these commands make. Well, I got some more FPS in the game, but you might not notice them because my screen recorder tends to drop FPS while I start recording my screen. Now let's move on to our next step. Now we are going to use console commands. You can easily enable the developer console from the in-game settings tab, and you can open the console by pressing the tilde key on your keyboard. First of all, you need to enable cheats to start making the console variables work. You can disable the FPS cap issue by adding FPS underscore max and setting its value to zero. Now follow me. You can download these commands from the description. Well, I know you haven't noticed anything after this step, but believe me, I got some more FPS when I'm not recording my screen. However, don't go anywhere because I have something more for you. Now you need to open your game's configuration folder, which is located inside your Steam folder, user data folder, your user ID, 730 folder, local, and then CFG. Now you need to open this file with Notepad. Now this key right here is very critical because it controls the screen percentage of the game. The default value is 1. But if you have set the Fidelity FX Super Resolution value to Performance Mode, then it will automatically set it to 0.5%, basically half. But you can put much lower values here to downgrade the resolution quality of the game without affecting the UI resolution, and I'm going with 0.1%. Now save the file and make sure to set the file attributes to read only. And yeah, I've left the download link for everything in the description box, so make sure to check it out. Now let's see how it performs. So now the game is pretty much playable and it's proving to provide even more FPS than before, and when I'm not recording my screen, I'm getting even more. So guys, that's it for today. Make sure to like and subscribe, and also share this video with your low-spec friends, so they can also enjoy playing Counter-Strike 2 on their low-end machines, and I'll see you all again in the next video, so until next time, take care, and bye. Affirmative. Roger that.